Good morning, good morning, good morning, you lovely lot. It is Sunday. I did sleep well after about half past two when I finally relented and took painkillers. Oh my goodness, that walk has left every part of me aching. My shoulders from carrying the rucksack, um, my arms, I don't quite know why my arms were aching. My hands were swollen at the end of it. I couldn't move my ring or anything, but that I find quite often happens when I'm on a big walk and my hands are like down for quite a long time. The blood sort of pools in my fingers. Um, so yes, oh, I did ache, I did. And I took painkillers and then I slept. Um, I don't know why I didn't do it sooner. I'm one of these people that's like, I won't take it unless I absolutely need it. And after dozing off and waking up at like half 12, dozing off, waking up at half one, dozing off, waking up again. I was just like, no, this is ridiculous. Every bit of me hurts, I just need to deal with it um the weather this morning is well was dire it was torrential rain and the wind has battered spog um really rocked him back and forth i don't know if you can see in the background we have a waterfall above my head um i would like to have a quick peek at that before i go and hopefully not get blown off the edge of the the escarpment um <laughs> but it is very blowy we were going to do a bike uh, bike ride not a bike ride we're going to do a boat ride and then walk back like take a i think we're going to do cat bells so i think we're going to is it called cat bells something bells we were going to go across on the boat and then do the hills and walk back um but after yesterday we hurt so very much and we did so much walking that we've decided that we'll take it easy today. We will walk, we will go on a boat ride, but we're not going to do like a hike. We'll go for a nice gentle stroll and look at something. Um, Daryl says, he's messaged me and he says they've been discussing between the two of them, him and Keith, indoorsy things or wet weather contingency plans for today. So if the boat's on, we'd like to go on the boat but with this wind, it might not. But we are at the top of a hill. Um, so it might not be so bad down where the boat is. But we'll find out. It's also Daryl's birthday today. So I've got a birthday card in there that I bought yesterday. I need to quickly write that up for him. Um, I sent him a present off of his, what do you call it? Uh, wish list, their Amazon wish list. Um, I bought them both a book because I hadn't yet got Keith anything. I was very bad. His birthday was before Christmas, I think. Um, so I've been very bad, but I sent them both a book off of their wish list, which they seem quite pleased with. Um, but for now, I'm slowly getting back into my sleepy mode. All right, no, <laughs> no, get up, Pip. For now, I'm going to write his birthday card, put it in my bag, and then I think we're off to find a cafe, I think. I mean, that will surprise you that we're going to go and find a cafe, but I think that's what we're doing. <laughs> to get busy here now so we need to move because we're obviously parked sideways on for the view but all the walkers are coming now so we need to be more considerate they're all going off up there
I'm being good again for five minutes till later when the cakes come out. Happy birthday. Thank you. You're welcome. Cheers. Cheers. Enjoy your breakfast. I will. Thank you. And then what are we doing? I'm opening cars. And then what are we doing? We're going on a boat. Woo! Be excited. This one, I know who it's from because she gave it to me. Oh. She didn't lick it. No, I didn't because it's COVID, you know. Mm. Don't do things like that anymore. Oh no, not at all. <laughs> <laughs> that one, happy birthday. It's fun to be on this adventure with you two. You two. Love Pippa and the gang of my Yeah. I'm you. I thought you'd like a funny one. Oh, I always like a funny one. That's why I'm with Keith. <laughs> to my lovely husband. Oh, who's that from then? <laughs> well, I don't think it's from the ex. <laughs> <laughs> Probably not, no. <laughs> Only it's, it's clean enough to read. Oh, good, that's all right then. Yeah, Is it? Right. You should know. I did it in the dark and the pen wasn't right. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, all my love, happy birthday from Keith. Aww. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Thank you. I gave him four kisses, I think, on mine. I get jealous. <laughs> what are you doing, Philippa? Philippa, am I in trouble? Um, You're a very naughty girl. Um, I'm filling out today's spots. I saw a 20 sign just up the road. Did you see that? I saw that. I'm going to do ticks today. Did you see that one? Oh, yes, I did. You did? I saw a Bentley. Bentley's not in the book, you can't have that. I, that's an extra 100 points then for something that's not in the book. It's not. If it's not in the book, you can't have it. Uh, I saw this one, but it had blue on it. Right, don't count. Because oh, that's no book. Okay, doesn't count. That's the Evil Knievel one, isn't it? Evil Knievel. Yeah, somebody jumping over a car. Yeah. On their motorbike. Yeah. I didn't see that. Now, I did see this one. Tourist information. Yes, saw that one. And I saw a campsite. Yes, saw that one. And I saw museum. No. I didn't see museum. Is it museum? I'm sure I saw museum. I didn't see museum. Yeah. Sure I did. I'm not seeing any of these pre-war boys signs, but I'm. Have seeing, you not? I've seen the black and white posts, but. Like the whole post is black and white stripes. Is that? Yeah, that counts. That, that place we came through and it had a big circle on the top. Yeah. Does that count? Yeah, that counts. Oh, well, I'm having it then. No, it doesn't count. Uh, Only I counts saw, for us. Counts for me. Well, I saw a truck route as well. Oh, I didn't see that one. Yep. But I'm a bit cross because we haven't seen any of these and we've clearly been up many of these. <laughs> Wait till later, you might see one. Okay. Um, we're next to a theatre, and I want to get all points by stepping into the theatre. You're so competitive. I'm not. I am, aren't I? Aren't I? Yeah, a little bit. Uh, and we decided hay bales that were not wrapped up were not counted. No, we're not counting them. They're all wrapped at the moment, yes. aren't they? As soon as I get home, I'll see the cricket green, so I can tick that one off. And my outdoor gym on the green. I can tick that off too. I thought this was just for on your road trips. Well, it's until I get home, it's on my road trip. If I drive in the village the right direction, I'll see it. You see? You see? Did I see a Porsche? No, BMW I'm thinking of. Very similar. I saw a Volvo and I saw a smart car. You're beating us today so far. Am I? Yes. I'm currently on, I got 265 points the first day and 260 points the second day. We've not tutted up for yesterday yet. No. Well, I've still got a lot to go today. I'm sure I'm going to see loads when we're on the water. You are going to see motorbikes and motorbikes. cycles, parking spaces. And I'll see lots of these, right? That's you will see, you'll see all of those. And the registrations. I yeah, need to stop paying attention to registrations, you will, don't I? Because there's lots of boat registrations. We should walk around the car park like train spotters. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing wrong with train spotters. No, don't be so insulting. Okay. We all have our hobbies, and this is currently our hobby. <laughs> <laughs> and because you bought us a book and we posted it on our Facebook page mm -hmm. and our Instagram page, 
you have become an influencer. It's nice to know I influence people. Because family and friends have now ordered the Ice Buy books. Because they didn't I know they were still going. I should be getting commission on you the Ice Buy. Ice Buy, if you wish to sponsor me, this is the second book that I have done <laughs> um, with friends. And I could definitely, with my whole childcare experience and background and everything else, could really sell your products for you. There you go. I was just commenting that it's unusual to find round chimneys. Lovely house. We are going on a boat tour. We're going to go round this, what's this lake called? Derwent. Derwent. Oh yeah, Derwent Water, it's on there. It's, it's not a Derwent lake, Water. It's, it's a water. A well it says lake trip here, so stick that in your pipe and smoke it. <laughs> um, and it's £12.50 for a big loop all the way round, which I think is absolutely worth it. We are going on the Lady Derwent Water. We all got the same. Yeah. Oh, yours is upside down. Did we get wooden forks? No. <laughs> Pudding. I've got so much footage to go through, it's ridiculous. You better check whether the Wi-Fi here, you might get Wi-Fi, you might be here for a while. Oh yeah, I, if they've got Wi-Fi, I can upload the first vlog, can't I? Oh, I'll leave that to do its thing. We've just spent the uh, day in Keswick, which was very lovely, drinking tea, going on a boat ride, having breakfast, just walking around, you know, just pootling and enjoying the scenery, that kind of thing. Um, we're heading off for our park up. It's suddenly got really wet, really rainy, although there does look to be some blue sky heading over. Um, but we've decided to just go and excuse me, go to the park up. Oh, there's fresh air. But we've stopped somewhere. The signpost, oh, I can't see the signpost now because Keith's parked in front of it. But Daryl says, oh, we want to show you something. Just a little something, just a little walk. It's very nice, you'll like it. <laughs> me being me, I'll go, okay, we'll do that. I'm all for being shown the sights. Um, 
and probably the dogs might have a little walk as well so i'm just gonna put my coat on and we're gonna head off on a little walk yeah is it a spaceship if i get in it will it fly away let's go and have a look shall we